As far as Tesco, they don't come much bigger than this for Salford City and Harrogate Town. The league's two top sides meet at the Peninsula Stadium with eight points between them. Salford can make that 11 with a third consecutive win this afternoon, while Harrogate, who haven't failed to score in a league match this season, will be hoping to cut the gap to five. And Tom Walker now from the right-hand side for Salford. In front of the Harrogate fans, plenty of yellow and black balloons behind that goal. But Walker, left-footed, hooks in towards the back post. It comes out to Redshaw, drills it in. And Belshaw gets down to keep that one out. As Redshaw's shot came in, it might have taken deflection on the way through. Walker gets back and just holds Thompson up. Plays the ball back to Fallowfield, chips over the top into Emmett. Still very tight on the touchline and he's seen out by Mafuta. And I suppose that's where you are going to see a more physical presence win a battle. Yeah, exactly. I mean, but, you know, just coming back to what you said about the couple of lads in the Harrogate midfield, small, but they're quick, aren't they? They move the ball quickly. And Good exchange by Maynard into Horton. Drifts out to the right, back through the middle into Redshaw. Redshaw returns it to Horton. Horton onto his left, tries to kill one in. Nasty deflection, Phoenix. Belshaw taps in by Phoenix at the far post. And Salford City take the lead in the 13th minute. Just as he did at the CNG Stadium, Mike Phoenix opens the scoring and Salford City are ahead. It's not the cleanest of finishes, but like we said, whatever team wants to win this one, and Phoenix has shown how much he wanted to get onto that one, coming in at the far post and making sure that one went over the line. Salford won, Harrogate nil. I think Thompson's standing closest to it, Leesley, I think. Yeah. We've seen this week, it's hard to decide if he's left or right footed, but Thompson rolls it to him, Leesley drives it, and Crocombe gets behind that. He read where it's coming. It was driven well and struck well by Leesley. It was on target, but Crocombe, it's an important save. And Nick Orson, who played him in, is going to take the core himself from the left hand side. Whips one in, low towards the near post. Phoenix bounces across the face, and Belshaw tips it away. Comes down to Maynard on the right hand side of the area now. Lowes Maynard, he's being shadowed at the moment, but he gets a low cross in, Nottingham. Trying to stab it, it comes off a Harrogate player. That's out from another corner. The great of Salford could just get that second goal. Crocum finds Nottingham into the area, drills it low across, and it comes down to Walker. Back in, there is 2 0. Tom Walker's first goal for the club. Route one from Crocum over to Nottingham. Nottingham drags it across. The sliding Harrogate defender took it away from Redshaw, but Walker was following the cross in and with a clinical finish, strokes Salford into a 2 0 lead here at the Peninsula Stadium. Salford City 2, Harrogate Town 0, and we played 25 minutes. What a strike from Walker! He's hit it low, he's hit it hard, it's in the back of the net, it's a Salford lad, that's what we want to see down here at Moor Lane. Salford 2, Harrogate 0, brilliant strike, Will, really was. I think what we see is almost instinctively Harrogate are always looking to work it to the left. Yeah. Unsurprisingly, you might say as well. Yeah, absolutely. Because and, and you know they've got a fair bit of success down that down that flank, haven't they? Yeah, in the game, Leesley causes problems, but you know I've always been impressed with Michael Nottingham as well. Um, just he's good at the back. He's good going forward. He puts in those little interceptions that you think but those interceptions are really important and uh, you know that's why now Horton driving down the middle for Salford onto his right he switched it out to Phoenix on the right hand side of the area puts another ball back over and Kennedy at the far post he'll be glad to see that one go up over the bar instead of into the roof of the net conceded a corner it'll be a throw for Harrogate on the right hand side Leesley into Knowles Knowles off to Swain Swain down to Leesley he's on side Cuts inside to Nottingham onto his right foot, puts cross towards far post, Ain't stretching for it, it's off the post, I think, and cleared by Salford. Crocum making himself bigger that near post, it's enough to put him off at least. And now Salford clear forwards. Horton cuts in field of Falkingham, centre ball, trying to switch it to the left for Redshaw, didn't quite get there. And now it's with Falkingham for the free kick, trying to line it up. Switching the ball to the left hand side, Nottingham heads it away. But Emmett plays it back to Swain, Falkingham. Burrell now just inside the Harrogate half. Salford keeping them away from goal at the moment. Swain plays it into, I think that's Fallowfield. Or is it Emmett? Jinx and Field into the muddy patch in the middle. And switches play out to the right to Fallowfield. Walker out to try and marshal him in field. Now Fallowfield driving in for Harrogate into the area. Tries to go for the short blocks. Still not cleared. It comes down to Knowles. Knowles! Great save from Matt Crocombe. It's not clear though. Leesley, ball back into the area, stretching. 
comes down to Knowles on the right hand side and it's a goal kick but that is a fantastic save from Max Crocombe but Leesley coming in field it's not really got any pressure on him as <coughs> he has to play about to Falkingham Falkingham through looking to play in Emmett Emmett lays it off for Falkingham Yellow shirts now streaming forward. Falkingham trying to cut outside of Mafusa. A soft one as goes down there, but it's another free kick in a good position for Harrogate. You know, Harrogate are winning those second second balls, which in the first half Salford were picking up. Um, so he's going to change it. Ask you, you know, what he'll give you, he'll give you, you know, plenty of pace. He's good in a tackle, um, and he just wants to liven up a bit. Leesley now good. free kick on the right hand side, calls and into a good area. Knowles gets Boss Crokeham and heads it into the back of the nest. Harrogate have one back, and that's exactly the danger yeah. that Salford have been fearing. A load of bacon onto the pitch at Crokeham. You don't want to see that from the fans as they throw stuff over. Oh, yeah. It's like all the lists are coming at Crokeham, but it's too easy. No one's gone with the runner. Now Horton to take on the left-hand side. Go short to Walker, back to Horton, whips the ball in towards the far post. It's headed clear by a Harrogate player. It's going to go out for... Oh, throwing off the corner flag. It's not actually gone out, but Pierjani is over there. He's won it on the right hand side. That's a great cross in, and Hogan heads it wide to the goal. But Pierjani having to react there. That's an excellent cross for a centre back. Brilliant. <laughs> to Pidge. Croker sends the ball forward. It's intercepted. Sends forward down to Thompson, touching the middle outside of Torre. But the run must have come in from Knowles and Pierjani gets it clear. Askew oh, holds off oh, the field, he gets around him as well. Salford oh, coming forward, oh, Askew oh, racing down the left hand side. Plays the ball into the middle, Dudley lets it go through to Walker. Tom Walker shoots and he drills it over the bar into the West Stand. Maybe just getting ahead of him there, Tom Walker. It's a great opportunity late on. It's a good break from Salford. Free kick for Harrogate anyway. Lifts it in from Falkingham towards the top of the area. It's headed away by Maynard. Back in by Harrogate. Comes down to Thompson. Drives it. It's a great block in from Liam Hogan. It's not clear though as Torre is fouled on his way out. That's a great block from Hogan as well. He's done well to uh, hold that one off. But Torre looking to get this one up towards the corner flag. Goes long. Looking for Beasley. Kennedy gets in there. It's a foul by Dudley on Kennedy. Free kick for how we go it? This is really their last time, the last chance to send it forward. Belshaw does that. Ainge flicks it on into Knowles, but it's cleared by Piergiani. The full time whistle goes, and Salford City are 11 points clear at the top of the Van Arama National League North after a 2 1 win over Harrogate Town.